Thomas Edison set a quota. He said, I need to have this many usable, testable ideas in a week. And every six months, I need to have something patentable in order to take something somebody else made or I made, repurpose it, and use it in an entirely new way. So ideational fluency was part of how his labs worked from day one. So his men were trained to do it. He was trained to do it. They worked at it all the time. Here's one I hope you enjoy. Um, and again, sometimes ideational fluency is how do you take it apart? How do you repurpose it? And sometimes it's just how do you use it in a very different fashion for a very different purpose? So this is a toy. It's a stocking stuffer. And it is one that my um, kids didn't get for Christmas. I didn't steal it. We just forgot to put it in the stocking. <laughs> it's made to float in your pool and be a light. This is the last day that I'm going to provide objects for you and ask you to do this. But you can do it anywhere, anytime, with almost anything. Um, you know, I do it with leaves and limbs from time to time. Um, so I use them to stop erosion. I use them to run through a machine and, and stop moisture uh, and hold moisture in my beds. And I need to use them for as many purposes as I can. Actually, thick enough leaves flat enough, wet enough, and you can stop weeds from growing through there. How do you look at what you use all the time? How do you look at it in a way to say, I need to repurpose it? I was just refinishing walls inside of our guest house, and it dawned on me that the people who did the work that my wife loved the most had done something to make the mud more fluid. So I bought a stirrer, poured water in the, in the mud, stirred it up, made it something like pancake batter, and I was able to do the effect that she wanted to. That was only 10 years in the making. I didn't say I was fast at everything. But 10 years later, I was able to look at it, see that they had made it more fluid, and learning how I do ideational fluency and how they did it, I could turn around and make my mud more fluid and make the effect closer to what my wife loves. <laughs> and that is a great day. <laughs>